Oh, hello again, everybody, and welcome back to Today in History. Today, May 21st, in 1819, uh, the first bicycles in the United States were introduced. They were called Swift Walkers back then, uh, and they were in New York City for the first time. In 1881, Clara Barton starts the American Red Cross today. In 1908, the first horror movie ever made, Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde, premieres in Chicago. In 1927, aviator Charles Lindbergh, uh, in the spirit of St. Louis, lands in Paris after his first solo air crossing of the Atlantic. And in 1932 today, after flying for 17 hours from Newfoundland, Amelia Earhart lands near Londonbury, Northern Ireland, becoming the first transatlantic solo flight by a woman. In 1999 today, All My Children star Susan Lucci finally wins a Daytime Emmy after being nominated 19 times, the longest period of unsuccessful nominations in television history. And today, in 2017, we said goodbye to the Barnum and Bailey Circus. They performed for the last time at the Nassau Coliseum. 146 years of the circus goes away. Born today, 1952, Mr. T, whose real name was Lawrence Tornald, uh, American actor, A Team, Rocky Three, born in Chicago, Illinois. So, happy birthday, Mr. T. And died today, 1935, Jane Adams, founder of the American Civil Liberties Union, uh, also creator of Hull House, uh, advocate for the poor in the United States. Today is National American Red Cross Founders Day, National Weight Staff Day, National Strawberries and Cream Day, and National Memo Day. And that's it for today, May 21st. Hope everyone has a great day today. Take it easy and catch me again tomorrow for Today in History. Bye-bye, everybody.